Well, hello and welcome to another episode of Just Like Truck. In today's episode, I'm going to become 100.3 DQ's next Hornet driver. That's on uh, DQ uh, 100.3 FM. I'm their next Hornet driver. You might wonder what a Hornet is. Some might say it's a type of aviary B. Others might say it's an awesome type of race series that people like me can race in. Being a one huge 100.3 DQ fan. Let me change. So, uh, big fan of Western Speedway. Big, big fan. Uh, I've been there numerous times. I moved here from Manitoba. And we didn't have any racing like this out there. We only dreamed of it. School bus racing? Come on, I'm there this weekend. I'll be signing autographs by the uh, the Hornet car in the in the lobby. You can uh, check me out there. I should also introduce the rest of my crew. I've got my crew chief, Matthew McLaren. Hi. Uh, Matt's been on the team now for uh, eight months. Roughly eight months, yep. Going on nine. Uh, he's been doing an excellent job so far in coaching me in uh, where to drive the Dodge, where not to. More of a I've also crew. got my uh, my spotter here, Lennon. He, uh, he keeps uh, keeps shit together. And uh, Keeps me out of the out of the cabbage. <laughs> there are a few reasons I might be actually am the perfect Hornet driver. I have my own helmet, DOT approved. I have my own fire suit, which is fire fire approved, fire retarded. retarded. <laughs> it's a little retarded. And I wear work boots at work because I turn wrenches for for a living at an undisclosed vehicle dealership. And we're having trouble making up the sale. Which leads us to the next reason why I'm the best Hornet driver out there. You gotta spin them to win them. You also gotta pin it to win it. And I live by those things I'm daily. I'm the next Hornet driver for 100.3 of the Today we're driving around this sign to let people know the need to come down to Western Speedway every Wednesday that there is Hornet racing to watch this guy right here race. So you wanna know a little bit about Noel Holmes? Nothing to tell you, sorry. But I will tell you that I have a lot of racing experience in my blood. I just can't come to think of it right now. Uh, yeah. Why don't we look at some clips from uh, back home? <laughs> Why don't we look at some clips from back in the day? These are my racing career. Here we have Noel on what could very well be the last uh, ride of the 71 car. Noel, how do you feel? I feel really good about today. Yeah? Uh, we've been looking forward to this race for uh, last week now, since uh, our last little casualty at uh, Talladega. Yeah. She's running good. <laughs> We're in for top three. Nice. Well, I'll, uh, let's hear it. Uh, why don't you start it up? Let's see what it sounds like. we gotta, we got to get a prime first. I need a 3 2 one. Let's hear it, folks. Three. Hey. Two, one. Oh, sounds good. Good luck to you today, Noel. Are you getting on two wheels or what? Ah, uh, sort of. Got some of the dirt on that one. It smells like Canadian tire out here. I'm not impressed. Some people might question my safety. And that is uh, a valid concern, because Noel's an idiot. And I'm really, almost got showered with dirt on that last one. Anyways, Joel, we now, signing off. I think 100.3 The Q needs a driver that is not from Langford. That's me, Sandwich, baby. We're gonna roll. We're gonna roll hard, and we're gonna roll fast. We're gonna spin him to win him, we're gonna pin it to win him with 100.3 The Q. And you know what? It's a great way to stay in shape. 